Hey guys, Noel here, and it's Wednesday, and before I go about my business for the afternoon, I thought it would be cool to do a quick YouTube video for the video game review section of the channel, which is something that I've been enjoying making some videos for, and we will actually do a uh, review on a handheld device for a handheld device. The handheld device that will be being reviewed is Sonic the Hedgehog 2 by Tiger Electronics. I've had this game since I was in elementary school. Tiger Electronics tends to get maligned by various YouTube video game personalities like Mark from Classic Game Room and the Angry Video Game Nerd. I really like Classic Game Room. I'm not a big video classic, uh, no, wait, Angry Video Game Nerd fan. I don't like Angry Video Game Nerd. I do like Classic Game Room, and I particularly like Classic Game Room's uh, R Zone reviews and skits, which got me thinking about Tiger Electronics. And the one Tiger Electronics that I really played a lot when I was younger, which is Sonic 2. And I actually had this. Uh, version of Sonic 2 long before I owned the cartridge of Sonic 2, which I first got in uh, junior high with this that was released late in the Genesis's life cycle. Um, so let's actually look at Sonic 2 here, the Tiger handheld version. I'm going to be trying to play this game like uh, Spider-Man here with my pinky and my index finger on uh, this right here because I'm holding the phone with the other hand. We'll turn it on and enjoy this charming jingle here. Uh, and this very cool uh, artwork of Sonic and Tails we got going on in the background here. So, this game's pretty straightforward. You kind of have Sonic and Tails here very well drawn. And you just kind of keep moving forward. And eventually, Dr. Robotnik will come on the screen. And uh, you'll have to hit him. There's seven levels in this game. At the end of each level is a Chaos Emerald at the top of the screen that you get after you beat Dr. Robotnik. Coconut's the monkey, who was a main character in the syndicated Sonic the Hedgehog animated cartoon. Well, all cartoons are animated, that's redundant. Uh, is uh, in the corner pelting us with bombs. If you get hit six times, you die. And each of the seven levels gets progressively harder. I have beaten this game, but I have not beaten this game since I was in elementary school. You can turn the music off if it's bothering you, but I personally don't mind this music. I just got a little invincibility power-up that goes across the screen in the top of it. That uh, timer on the bottom means that Robotnik is coming. I personally keep getting stuck right now in the second level of this, which is um, Chemical Plant. So I got hit too many times, so I just died. Because um, I keep falling in the water, and I can't figure out how to get out of the water. There's a way out of it. Here's Robotnik. So the key is to hit him when his spike's not out. Which I just did, anyway. I beat him. Now we go jump to the top. Grab that Chaos Emerald. And we beat the level. Yay! All right. Here's level two, which I keep getting stuck at. And um, if I'm not careful, I'm going to fall in the water here. Because those platforms uh, have no <laughs> nothing under them but water. When you fall under, there's two other badnik robots. One is a seahorse, and the other one's like a little squid. I mean, yeah, I fell in the water. I don't know how to get out. I did know how to get out of this before, but no, I don't. Oh, there's a squirrel. Hey, squirrel buddy. Okay, back to Sonic. <laughs> oh, I got out! Hey! I didn't even realize how I got out of the water! <laughs> I was looking at that squirrel and just hitting buttons. All right, good deal. Thank you, Mr. Squirrel. Oh, man, I'm back in the water. Mr. Squirrel, come back. I need your help. How did I do this? Man, this is terrible. I figured out how to get out of the water without even knowing how to get out of the water. That six seconds, four seconds, I'm going to drown. Oh, no. I'm... All right, so let's just leave it at that right here. We'll turn this off. 
There we have it, guys. That's Sonic 2 by Tiger Electronics. And apparently I can't get past the second level without the help of a magic squirrel that exists outside my window. I'm going to go outside and see if I can catch him, and then we'll do a review with him later on, and he can be my co-host when Santino's not around. Uh, but then, uh, you know, who knows what will happen. Maybe we'll do a three-man show. Uh, anyway, I have to go get my two laptops repaired, and I hope you enjoyed this video. Sonic 2 by Tiger Electronics. It's a quality game. I enjoy it. I think it's something that totally should be in the R zone. I would go in the R zone and play this game, and it's definitely a Tiger Electronics game that does not suck, which is good. Uh, so until next time, guys, my name's Noel. You take care of yourselves, and I'll see you all later. Bye-bye.